Hey guys, it's Andy Elliott. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to take an inbound call, inbound, an inbound call, which means somebody is calling the dealership, and I'm going to show you how to be different than anybody else in the world, crush it and kill it. Check it out. All right guys, so here we go. So this is gonna be a video about how to take an inbound call. By the way, outbound calls, calling an internet lead, Okay, taking inbound calls, those are a part of the business that you must be very, very good at if you're gonna dominate it, especially try to ever earn half a million a year selling, okay? Um, a lot of people stand, they live and they die by the gate outside, okay? I'm out. Look, look, you can stand out there all you want, but this internet world up here, it's dropping down leads into the internet department and it's dropping in phone calls coming into the store. And if you're really good at this, all those people standing outside, they can be your door greeter, bringing people inside to see you because you're good on the phone, okay? So I'm gonna show you how to take an inbound call. Now number one, I want you to just do me a favor. Take a piece of paper like this, draw a line across it right now. Everybody grab something to write with. Come on, man, you guys know if you train with me, I'm gonna make you great, okay? And I'm gonna bring good value to you today. This is gonna change your life. Draw a line across it, okay? And when you're drawing the line across it, I want you to write at the beginning, open, and then at the end, I want you to write close. Like I'm opening the call and then I'm gonna close it at the end. Okay, so at the open part, I want you to put great greeting. What does a great greeting mean? That means this, I'm gonna compliment someone, I'm gonna say something nice, even before they get a chance to tell me what they need. I want you to listen to what I just said to you. I'm going to compliment them or say something nice to them. I'm gonna compliment their day before I even let them tell me what they need. So you say, Andy, give me an example of that. So the phone rings, ring, ring. Ready, here's Andy. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Andy. A lot of you leave comments telling me that you need help. Do me a favor, I'm gonna tell you the best way to get a hold of me. Shoot me a text message right now, 918-210-0254. 918-210-0254. I'll help you with whatever you need. I got your back for life. Let's get back to the video. Hope you're having the best day of your life. This is Andy, ABC Ford. How can I help you today? There you go. Hope you're having the best day of your life. This is Andy, ABC Ford. How can I help you today? That's a great greeting. Now some of you may say, ah oh, man, I don't like saying all that stuff. You're right. You hate people. You just keep staying small. For the rest of us, hope you're having the best day of your life. ABC Ford, how can I help you today? Man, think about if somebody answered the phone with you that way. You'd be like, dude, I like this guy. Or man, I like her. She's really nice. Isn't that the whole purpose, to get people to like you on the phone so they'll trust you to come in? Okay, hint, hint, great greeting. Now, once I say, hope you have the best day of your life, this is Andy, how can I help you today? They say, Andy, I was calling to get some information on that 2018 F-150. Now what do they do? They tell me what they need. What are we going to do next? We're not going to say, got the stock number? Like a dummy. We're gonna say, hey, no problem. Who do I have the pleasure of speaking with? Write that down. Hope you have the best day of your life. This is Andy, how can I help you today? Client says, this is what I need. You're gonna say, no problem. Who do I have the pleasure of speaking with today? The guy says, my name's Tom. Tom, it's a pleasure to speak to you. Hey, by the way, Tom, write this down. By the way, and say their name. Tom, I just reset my computer. Write this down. I just reset my, I'm gonna give you two things to say here. I just reset my computer. It's gonna take me about 30 seconds and then I'm gonna get you all the information you need. By the way, where are you calling from today? Or you're gonna say, hey Tom, I'm just pulling up my computer, it's gonna take me about 30 seconds, and then I'm gonna get you all the information you need. Write this down, by the way, where are you calling from today? We're gonna to roll out. So, I'm training you, so now I'm gonna move fast. I'm gonna kinda of roll through this. Ring, ring, hope you're having the best day of your life. This is Andy, how can I help you today? Hey Andy, I was calling to get some information on that 2018 F-150. Hey, no problem. Who do I have the pleasure of speaking with today? Uh, my name's Tom. Hey Tom, it's awesome meeting you. By the way, Tom, I just reset my computer. It's gonna take me about 30 seconds and I'm gonna get you all the information you need. By the way, where are you calling from today, Tom? Just like that. Now what am I doing? Write this down. Remember I said that line? You got the open, right? You got your great greeting. You got pleasure to get your name, right? Who do I have the pleasure of speaking with? And then you wrote, I just reset my computer, or I just pulled my computer up, it's gonna take me 30 seconds. Now, stop. Right there, 
I want you to write, why did I say I just reset my computer? Why did I say I just pulled up my computer and then I'm gonna get them all the information they need? By the way, where are you calling from today? Write this down, creating the gap. We are going to create interest, a relationship and a connection with you and that client. See, because I'm gonna explain something to you. The customer's job is to call, get the information as fast as possible and get the hell off the phone, okay? and they ain't coming in. Your job is to answer the phone, build a relationship, slow down the cell, and ensure that they come in on an appointment. You feel me? For those of you out there right now that love this, go ahead and comment below and say, hey Andy, love the training. Appreciate you guys. Okay, now that's called creating the gap. Now I want you to write down two, three, or four questions that we will ask when we say, hey, I just reset my computer, or hey, I just pulled up my computer, it's gonna take me 30 seconds, and I'm gonna get you all the information you need, okay? By the way, question number one, by the way, where are you calling from today? And they're gonna say where they're calling from. Say, oh, no ways, we do a lot of business there, that's awesome, I got family there. You're gonna start a relationship. Your goal is to get them talking about themselves. Wah, 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 wah. We want them talking, why? When they talk to you, they feel more comfortable, now you guys make a connection. You feel me? By the way, where are you calling from today? Number two, have you had the chance to drive one of these yet? Write that down. Hey, hey Tom, have you had the chance to drive one of these yet? No, I haven't. Oh man, you're gonna love it. Hey, have you had the chance to drive one of these yet? Yeah, I have. Cool, man, how many have you drove? I drove three. What the, Tom, you drove three of these trucks and you ain't bought one yet? Was nobody making you a good deal? What's going on, man? Nah, man, nobody can get me approved. Oh, now I know what's going on. Or, nah, man, nobody will give me enough for my trade. Tom, man, forget those people, dude. You know what? We're, we're actually known in the industry for giving the most for people's trades. Right now, we're giving 20 to 30% more than most car dealerships. You're going to love us. See? Now I know what's going on. By the way, where are you calling from today? Okay? Number two, what is it? Have you had the chance to drive one of these yet? Number three, by the way, is this vehicle going to be for you? Is there going to be somebody else driving it? And then number four, Hey Tom, are you gonna be replacing anything? We love trade-ins here, Tom. Don't tease me. Don't tease me, Tom, what do you got? Tom's got a trade-in. Once he's done and he gives me all that information, do I have a connection with him? You bet your butt I do. Now, what am I gonna do? I'm going to say, hey Tom, I wanna let you know my computer's back up, and then what am I gonna do? 30 second power cell. Or I'm gonna say, hey Tom, just wanna let you know I actually pulled up that truck on my website. We still got it, Tom. And then go into a 30 second power cell. You feel me? Now, what is a 30 second power cell? What is that? A 30 second power cell is where literally we are going to put the sizzle on the steak. You want me to show you what that looks like? Hey Tom, by the way, where are you calling from today? Oh man, that's awesome. Oh, cool, have you had the chance to drive one of these yet? By the way, Tom, is this truck gonna be for you? Oh, okay, awesome, man. And then by the way, Tom, are you gonna be replacing anything? Don't tease me with a good time, Tom. We love trade-ins, man. Tell me what you got. And he tells me about it. I say, hey, Tom, just want to let you know my computer came back up. Man, I've got this truck. Listen, Tom, ready for 30-second power sale? Tom, 1 to 10, this truck's an 11, Tom. It's an 11. 1 to 10, it's an 11. Tom, even though this truck's pre-owned, it's going to be like brand new for you and your family. Also, Tom, literally, if you were here and I covered the odometer, I made you guess how many miles are on this truck, even though it's got 30,000 miles on it, you would guess it had zero miles on it. It's that nice. Tom, I'm looking out the window right now. This 2018 model sitting next to a 2022. Literally, it's so nice, it looks like a freaking 2022 model. Tom, I know this. I want you to come in, touch it, feel it, smell it, and in the end, it's your decision, but you're gonna love this truck. It's one in a trillion. Tom, can you make it in right now, or would after work be best? What's gonna be best? I just rolled straight through an entire phone call. Okay, listen to me. I want you to write something down. The person that knows their inventory the best makes the most money. I need you to understand some rules about answering an inbound phone call. Rule number one, don't ever put anybody on hold. I hate being put on hold and so do you. So stop putting people on hold. You know why you're putting people on hold? Because you're unprepared. You don't walk your inventory in the morning. You don't go to trade row. You don't go to the service drive. You don't go to the lot. You don't check things out. You literally roll in to work with your hair not fixed and you rush up to your office and you jump into your seat and you start taking phone calls unprepared and wasting the dealership's money. Stop it. You're, you're wasting your time and you're not growing yourself. Know your inventory, okay? I don't need to put anybody on hold. By the way, can I ask, do you have the stock number? I guess, but I would know myself because I know everything. 
because I'm a freaking professional. I know, I know my industry. I know my job. My job is to ensure that I know my job better than anybody else in the world. That's your job too, okay? So I need you to know that like when you answer the phone, be an expert, be the trusted advisor, be a pro, don't be an amateur. And then by the way, let's go to that 30 second power sell. Let's go back to the end of the, the phone call here. 30 second power sell, basically sell the sizzle on the steak, drive it home. I want them to say, dang, man, because you're about to ask them to come in, right? I want them to be like, dang. So when you say, hey, Tom, by the way, right? When can you make it in? Right now or would after work be best? That's the close. Don't say this. Hey, Tom, what would be best? Can you come in at 345 or will 415 work best? Dude, everybody says that. It's so freaking outdated. Please stop saying 330 or 415. Please stop saying 630 or 715. It sounds stupid. I know. I know. Someone taught you that. Don't say it. Say, can you make it in right now or would after work be best? And then they'll say, I, I can make it right now. Cool, man. Hey, by the way, what are you pulling up? Hey, whoo, whoo. Let's cover something real quick because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to cover this on the end of this video and it's going to help you make more money. When I set the appointment and they're coming in and Tom says, hey, Andy, I'm going to make it down right now. What am I going to do? All right, Tom, we'll see you soon. No. Say, hey, Tom, no problem. By the way, Tom, when I hang up, I'm going to text you the address to the store. Just hit maps. Boom. It's going to take you straight to me. Number two, Tom, I'm going to take a picture of me. So I can send it to you. So when you get here, when you ask for Andy, you know what I look like. I put a name with the face, okay? Can't wait to meet you. And number three, what color of car are you gonna be pulling up in, Tom? So when you're here in 35 minutes, I know it's you when you pull up. That's doing a good job, okay? So I want you to think about a couple things. Did we have a great intro? Yeah. Did we get their name? Yeah. How many times did I use Tom's name over and over and over and over again? Probably 10, 15 times. Why do I keep saying Tom? Why do I keep saying this person's name? Because every time you say somebody's names, their ears perk up. Because if you sound like you know each other now. Do you guys want to have a relationship or no relationship? I want a relationship. I want to have a connection with my clients. Do you want them to hang up the phone and call the next dealership? Or do you want them to hang up the phone and head your way? All that will decide on how you answer the phone. So guys, if you listen to this video right now and this has helped you, how much did this video cost you? Absolutely nothing. It cost you nothing. It was free, F-R-E-E. -E. You know what that means? That means that I want you to study it, I want you to practice it, but I want you to go to another level. How are you gonna go to another level? It's really simple. You're going to have to study and you're going to have to have a training system to study and train on. I've created a process and a system on how to teach salespeople to earn a half a million a year. I call it Project 500. It's the world's number one training system and I would love to show it to you. Okay? If you're wanting to earn a half a million a year and you're currently not, I want you to send me a text message. My direct cell phone number is 918-210-0254. Write that down right now. 918 210-0254, okay? And I want you to text me, hey Andy, my name is Tom. Um, I'm interested in making a half a million a year. Tell me about Project 500. I'll reach out and talk to you. And by the way, can I ask you a question? Did I bring value to your life in this last video? Did I bring value to your life? In the video you just watched, did I bring value to you? Do you feel like you'll be better if you study this? Well, here's what I'll tell you. This is nothing. We're not even scratching the surface on the stuff that I'm gonna teach you inside of Project 500. I love you guys, I got your back for life. Shoot me a text message, I'm gonna make you the best in the industry. Let's kill it. Hey guys, I just wanna tell you, you're the true one percenters, you made it till the end of the video. Do me a favor, share it with the friend that wants to go to another level. Make sure you like the video, comment below so I know who you are, set your notifications, and then subscribe to the channel. We got daily sales training videos dropping, I'll see you soon.